In recent years, the increase in homeless pets has led to an overpopulation within South Carolina animal shelters. Despite having so many adoption events, many shelters within the state have declared a state of emergency. There's just too many animals being abandoned, too many dogs and cats being abandoned in our shelters today. And uh, they have forced these shelters into crisis. Overcapacity is defined as capacity beyond what is normal, allowed, or desired. Last year, Palmetto Lifeline and Columbia Animal Services reached the maximum capacity of animals within their shelters. According to Post and Courier, Palmetto Lifeline was 27 animals over their set capacity of 150. Columbia Animal Services was 44 pets over the maximum capacity of 148, with most cages containing more than one dog. So um, the overpopulation is really, um, we partner with City of Columbia and Lexington County Shelters, and we pull so many animals from their shelters. Out of all breeds, pit bulls make up the majority of animals surrendered within shelters. This has been as a result of a large stigma behind pit bulls and their behaviors. If you don't train them and socialize them from the age of eight weeks until two years of age, and there's got to be constant intense training, you can have some serious behavioral issues. Everybody was getting puppies during COVID. So we couldn't socialize during COVID. Puppies couldn't socialize during COVID. So now they're having some of these behavioral problems that the families can't afford or they can no longer afford to take care of them. Shelters are also facing a large number of pets with underlying medical conditions. Due to heightened intake and lack of medical resources and staff, shelters have had a difficult time accommodating to the medical needs of their animals. Percent of the population has, has basically left the workforce. Um, the, uh, many of the shelters are understaffed when it comes to um, their facilities and they have far too many animals there and not enough staff to, to take care of them. Despite overcapacity being a major issue within South Carolina animal shelters, there are still ways around it. Spaying and neutering your dogs and cats when they are at least six months old can help reduce pet overpopulation in both homes and shelters. Fostering is also a viable option for potential adopters to see if they can effectively take care of a pet before they adopt. Look at some of the senior pets that have been there for the longest. Those are the ones that have been waiting for a home and they may not be brand new to you, but they can still make amazing pets. There are also many steps the community can take without having to own a pet themselves, such as volunteering at your local animal shelter and donating items such as food and toys. A lot of times we have busy lives, we have, you know, children and school and families and things that we need to take care of that are important. But if you have the resources and you have a kindness in your heart, you can help animals. Taking these steps can help to decrease overpopulation and homelessness among pets in the community. Reporting for Ernie TV Live, I'm Zoe Beecroft.